from the left side of the road as you go to Barawi. Kwa kineko jumbe za Rambi Rambi zimeendelea kumiminiwa marehemu Lizi Wanyoike ambaye ni mwanzilishi wa taasisi ya mafunzo ya usimamizi wa biashara hapa jijini Nairobi NIBS wanafunzi, walimu na familia wamemsifia kama mwalimu mwenye utu na ambaye siku zote alikumbatia masomo sana. Marehemu Lizi aliaga dunia siku ya Jumapili wiki iliyopita. Mwanahabari Catherine Emuragate anaeleza wasifu wake marehemu Lizi Wanyoike. Katika ofisi hii ya mwenda zake Lizi Wanyoike Sahi ni ishara maalum kwa waliopata usaidizi kwa mama huyo. Alitumia ikilinganishwa na bidii yake usiku na mchana kuleta furaha kwa na jamii. Lakini sasa kufuatia kifo chake, upweke ulioko katika afisi hii hakika unazidisha huzuni kwa ufanyikazi katika taasisi hii ya mafunzo ya biashara jijini Nairobi Nibs na kwa wale waliofaidika kwani watakosa bashasha na kamwe hawatatangamana ila tu kwa wema wake. Wasemavyo wa Swahili mzigo wa mwenzio ni kanda la usufi. Kwa wanyoike utu wake haukumpa nafasi kumwacha mtu ateseke. Marehemu Lizi aliwapa tabasamu wanafunzi wengi tu kwa kuwafadhili kimasomo. She is a loving mom, she understood me and she agreed to be sponsoring me partially. So she has been paying my fee from last year March to this moment and uh, she has been paying half of my fee. And uh, I want to believe that God will pick me from there. And so, yes, I've been a beneficiary from her labor and from her work that she has been doing. The first time I met her, actually, I felt like I've met my mom. Madam was an inspiration to me. And me joining here, I joined because I could listen to her, the way she was encouraging students, saying everything is possible and you can do anything that she wants. Mwalimu mkuu wa Akademi ya Shule hii ya Nibs anasimulia uhusiano waliokuwa nayo marehemu Lizi wafanyikazi na wanafunzi. She has empowered everybody. Uh, she also listens to the many also challenges that uh, staff members face. Uh, many of us have approached her for soft loans uh, which at a time she even forget forgot that uh, she had given you a loan. Uh, still, uh, on the staff, she has been part and parcel of the NIPS welfare uh, endeavors, where any time a NIPS staff is bereaved, maybe is sick, uh, maybe there is a wedding or other ceremonies, she always contributes, and her contribution is so conspicuous. Nyumba ni kwake mwenda zake mtaa wa Garden Estate hali si tofauti. Huzuni umegubika nyuso za familia. Wanakumbukumbu za miaka walioketi na kupiga gumzo pamoja na Lizi alipokuwa hai. We, we have lost uh, somebody very special. Very very special. But uh, we are now celebrating her. Now when she grew up it was like you know, if you want to do some business or want to start something, me, me, even, you know, I'm slightly older than her. If I want to do some businesses, I'll find out first of all, is there another business like here, around here? Me, when I see somebody there, oh, there is, a, for example, somebody has put uh, some salon there, and another one, here, yes, I, uh, that one I'm not touching. Ha, she will say, oh, good. Here, I'm going to put it in the middle, in the middle now of these three people. Alikuwa mwanakamati mwenye upendo furaha mchapa kazi Lizi hangiruhusu mtoto yote yule akose masomo Msaidizi wake anasema kwamba mwenda zake alikuwa tayari wakati wowote kusaidia na kuelekeza situ wanafunzi bali pia wana jamii What most really startled me is that she helped people she never knew She educated children that she never met Sometimes we, she could send us to go and see those children uh, because she can't be everywhere. Then she was very kind because she didn't not only sponsor the, the NIBS students, she sponsored even children in high school, whichever high school, and uh, also children in primary school, uh, and she even sponsored students from university. Marehemu Lizi Wanyoike aliaga kutokana na ugonjwa wa saratani na atazikwa siku ya Jumanne.
Catherine Imuragate Kitchen News Nairobi Tazamaji taarifa hiyo ya Catherine ndio inatukamilishia taarifa za KTN 